Hello everyone, welcome to Zone Trader, where we trade safely using different techniques and make money management a priority. So December has not been the best month to trade for sure. Uh, Jerome Powell announced yesterday at the December FOMC a 0.5% interest rate hike. So that was what was expected. Uh, slightly bullish for Bitcoin and crypto in general, but um, we saw a uh, buy the rumor, sell the news situation. Not too much selling though. Uh, looking at the total crypto market cap, it only lost, uh, let's see, so that was the announcement. And we are here. So that's 4.0.7% uh, loss, which for crypto is really not much. Now looking at Bitcoin, um, same thing. Let's see. 5.21.24 So the looking at the chart, uh, of course, let's see how really it doesn't look too too good at the moment. Uh, not horrible. It's not drastic, but I wouldn't be surprised to see a little more retracement. Uh, EMAs 21 and 55, the blue and yellow lines are about to cross, although. Hmm. And the RSI is not completely oversold just yet, but maybe a few hours, maybe a few days. Again, nothing drastic, but uh, for now, the moon boys are hibernating and they've been for a while and they're tired. Now, some info we need to keep an eye on, I think, regarding the CBDC is the fact that the Federal Reserve Bank of Boston is working with MIT on Project Hamilton, or the Hamilton Project, which is a CBDC research model, and they've been for a few years now. To give you an idea of where this is going, um, this is a quote from Alexander Hamilton, no society could succeed which did not unite the interest and credit of rich individuals with those of the state. All communities divide themselves into the few and the many. The first are rich and well-born, the other the mass of the people. The people are turbulent and changing, they seldom judge or determine right. So basically, Hamilton believed that people couldn't be trusted to manage their own money. So a centralized authority should do it instead. Now, looking at the uh, Project Hamilton white paper, interesting to note that Corey Field, the current Bitcoin um, core project developer, is also working with the Federal Reserve to create a CBDC, so a central bank digital currency. And he's not the only one. I'm going to butcher her name, but um, Niha Nabrula. Um, she is the director of the Digital Currency Initiative at the MIT Media Lab and the head of the Project Hamilton. But what's worrying a little bit is that she sits also on the World Economic Forum's Global Blockchain Council, which is interesting. For your information, the uh, World Economic Forum issued a volume titled COVID-19, The Great Reset. And they only have four stories. Oh. And this discussed the fate of the US dollar. Uh, in here, they state there are attempts to launch national digital currencies that may eventually dethrone the US dollar supremacy. So trying to kill crypto and Bitcoin, declaring everything a security and the Transparency Act, uh, you can look at this project, I will uh, link in the comment section, It's not helping. All of this is not helping. But despite all of this, I'm not worried. Crypto is like the Hydra. You get one head and two grow back. Looking at the FTX scandal, you cut the head of Bitcoin's head here. It was at 21, 3000, 21, to be exact. And right now we are at 17,400, 17,500. 
So it's really not much, not a big drop for something as huge as the FTX scandal. And in the meantime, um, there is still plenty of time to make profit. If you want to see more videos on the profits you could make on a regular basis through our Discord group, the latest crypto news and relaxing video for traders, please be sure to subscribe. Have a great day, guys. Bye.